Okay, picture this. Kids, their heads buried in their cell phones texting. Mm -hmm. Maybe even parents catching themselves doing the same thing. Sound like your home? If not, if so, you are not alone. News Channel 9's Lauren St. Germain explores a generation centered around technology and how it is affecting the family. Lauren. Kim Calvin, texting is one of the most popular and fastest ways to communicate. But what happens when texting has taken over? I wanted to know if this is changing the way families talk to each other and how parents can win back their kids' attention. Hey, okay. here you go. Guys, breakfast. Sound familiar? So Hello. Totally with you. Kids, put your dishes in the dishwasher. Okay, no, that's it. Everybody, gadgets down now. From modern family to your family, texting and high-tech gadgets have taken over. He doesn't even seem to notice when it's ringing, but he knows when there's a text. Okay, can you get your sisters, Isaiah? Eva Challen is a single mountain mom of four, including 16-year-old Isaiah. It concerns me that he's on them all the time, but... That's how he keeps in touch with everybody, and if I need to reach him, that's how I have to reach him. I have to text him. He won't answer the phone. Put this on the table, please. Isaiah and Eva aren't alone. So you can start serving. According to Pew Research, teens who text send an average of 30 messages a day. And, and it'll even be like he's downstairs and we're upstairs and we tend to text each other. Amen. Dinner time, we generally don't let him do it at the table, but he does have them at the table, so we'll hear it going off. Mm -hmm. I'll see him <laughs> texting someone back every once in a while. But it's not just texting at dinner. Hey, use your fork. Family time gets a little bit harder because he does want to sit out there and be on it. Or while trying to have family time. Sometimes we do have to kind of be like, you've just got to put it away. It's texting and talking. Okay, Isaiah, come on. Or texting and listening. The problems extend beyond the kids and Eva knows it. I got addicted to it. She'll be like, mom, 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 and I'm, you know, constantly checking something. So we wanted to know what advice psychologists at Lee University had for minimizing and maximizing. <laughs> Their message is blunt and may be difficult for parents to hear. Before you begin to make changes in your child's behavior, I say that you begin with the phone in your own hand. I think parents can model um, giving uh, uh, direct, undivided attention at certain times. Yeah, we know. Easier said than done. I encourage them to have some specific times where electronics are put away. You know. Including theirs. It's very hard because I'm on mine all the time. Have conversations with your children during dinner and throughout the day, and you'll find that they will want to have more face-to-face -face conversations with you as you open that uh, line of communication and make it available for them. We're having a family reunion this summer, and I was talking with my sister, and I said, we're going to have to literally have a basket where people put their phones. And both psychologists emphasize the importance of looking at your own behavior and making changes yourself so your kids will take you seriously. And Dr. Sargent also said something else about texting that caught my attention. He said it feeds an innate need to socialize, giving us instant gratification. I can understand that. Yeah. yeah really, cool. I mean, it's, it's a part of your, you miss, lose your phone, you say, I lost my right arm. Yeah. You know, so heard people it's say that. It's just, technology is just taking over and texting is fulfilling our need and desire to be social. And see, I grew up in a generation where you just, you talked. You talked. We didn't do it by phones. If you wanted to ask somebody something, you wanted to tell them something, you get right in their face and tell them. But sometimes you got to go find the people. Texting, just bing, 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 done. There yeah. you go. Mm -hmm. See? Good point, Lauren. Thanks, Thank Lauren. you very much. Good story. Thanks, Lauren. Thanks.